I'm Shovel and welcome to my channel. Today we're back on Harmony Hollow again. We made some changes since last time because I did do a live stream on Twitch. Make sure you're following me on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash ShovelYT. I made some home improvements. I still need to figure out the flower field. I think that it probably might have been fine, but I was having lag, so maybe it was for the best to get rid of them. Let's go around the outside first. Everything is the same. I have a couple of sheep here because I was really needing wool for some of the builds and different things I was doing. I put a small wheat farm back here. What we're gonna want is cows. Cows are hard to come by, but sheep will do for now. Woo! Okay, so past the wheat farm, around this side, I was desperately needing food. So I finally started a little potato farm here. <gasps> There's a baby ocelot in the bushes. Oh, there's its mama! Oh, there it is! I love living here. Oh, also I had to separate these guys. The baby flying Kieran that, that I bred these two to have, he died because Cloud looked at him. Cloud has fire aspect with his eyeball, so whatever he looks at will light on fire, and it died. And then this guy started using his antlers to try and kill Cloud, but then I found out that you can turn off the fire aspect in the power settings. I checked his power settings to turn off kick damage before I ever named him Cloud, which is what gave him flame aura and protection aura. So flame aura is gone now, but the damage has been done. <laughs> I also have a parrot over here. I put him in timeout because he kept making creeper sounds. I also have all of this sugar cane because we were in the middle of adventuring in the Twilight Forest. I did end up coming back out, but I will be going back in what I need, and I believe I have is glowstone, raven feather, sugarcane to have paper, and these torch berries so that I can make the certain map in the Twilight Forest to try and find the ram guy who has all of the rainbow oak trees because I wanna have a rainbow forest. I just wanna go all in on the magic. First of all, I was gifted this skeleton horse in one of them nets and I didn't know he was already in there. So we have a skeleton horse. I put in all the windows I organized my chests a little bit. This is not where they're gonna stay. I am gonna have a chest room. And I made the floor birch and the ceiling the blue oak. I added birch doors. So now the floor plan is much more open. And you might notice I have these elevator blocks here because we have our upstairs attic area where I have already decorated with some Mr. Crayfish. We have our computer and printer with our little desk chair. I got this chiseled carpet and also this chiseled carpet. I have this TV stand, which this is my favorite part about this. This TV stand is made up of three separate blocks and the way that the separate blocks look is like this. This is the same block, it's a modern TV stand. When you take one of these away, it becomes like this. When you take one of these away, it becomes like that. But it looks so much better as the full TV stand. I didn't know they kind of like clicked together like that. That was awesome. Got a little stereo. I didn't know I played music till right now. I mean, I did use a note block and how do I turn it off? Okay, that was the only way that I could figure to turn it off. And we have our clock here, which is not set to the right time. It is six. 53 daytime in Minecraft, this says 2.20, so that's not the correct time. That's everything that I did in the house. We were going mining for iron to keep working on getting fairy lights to decorate up there because you need iron for each of the bulbs. What I wanted to do was actually start working on H's area. I agreed to do his stupid dragon lair, so I think what I wanna do, I'm gonna need to repair this. I need a better pickaxe. I'm so far behind everybody. H was showing me all this cool stuff, and I'm so far behind, and now I have to do this job for him, which is only gonna put me even farther behind. Ooh, here's the layer. Let's just go from bottom to ceiling. The hardest part is gonna be that it is so tall, but I can work ceiling down to the floor. It's 12 tall. So start seven tall, up to 12 tall. And then here's what I wanna do. One, two, three, four, five. And then it's three, and then it's two, and then it's two, and then it's one, one, and again. So three and then two and then two and then one and then one and then two and then two and then three and then five. So that's how we make the shape of the circle. So those are all the numbers I need for hollowing it out. I also need to make sure I'm low enough more than two blocks below this with, between the ceiling and, and this floor. I guess I'll just put this here and then I'll have to go back up. I don't know how I'm, right? 
Oh, why did I agree to this? <laughs> this is definitely gonna be the hard part. Filling it back in with stuff and decorations is gonna be the easy part. Cat him. <laughs> this is a whole other day. This is four hours of progress. I'm not even done just clearing the room after four hours. It's mostly cobble, but I decided might be a crazy idea, but I think I'm gonna go for it. Instead of building this layer for his like sparkly midnight dragon, whatever her name was, he'll be sure to remind me later. What if we build it for the aether dragon? Oh, I don't have them in here anymore. I was gonna show off all my aether blocks and, and like quartz. We can build it for the aether dragon, use our holy stone that we have extra left over from our house, all of our extra quartz. That way I don't have to worry about also spending the time getting materials. That's a different dragon. That's a different dragon. What are you? You're a whole different kind. This one's cool. The layer, the layer I'm gonna build is probably gonna be exactly opposite of this. I'll do like little bits of water in the floor and water flowing from the wall. I'll use glowstone still and it'll be, it'll be like quartz bricks and things. I'm, I'm copying, he told me copy and paste. So I did that. But I'm allowed to build it however I want to. He can't complain. Let's just check if I have TNT. And then also we can check. Wait a minute. Where did my, where did my house go? Why does this keep happening? No, mine got removed again. I haven't even been home. Why is it deactivated again? Why is this happening to me? And now mine's all the way here. So I have to go through and do this again. We're definitely gonna build the quartz and the holy stone just cause I have so much. And it wouldn't be the hardest thing to get more of. I even have some extra saplings and leaves. Can we use the clouds? I could always go back in and get more of that too for myself. I wonder if that would work instead of using glass to cover over the water. All right, we got our work cut out for us. Let's do it. Okay, <laughs> I spent the last hour and a half uh, I borrowed some tools from H, so I have his efficiency pickaxe that I just keep repairing. But what I managed to come up with so far, I just need to make another run into the aether for some more clouds and holy stone. But so far it's looking pretty good. I think I'm gonna do waterfalls on these big parts of the room too, instead of just the corners. I put glowstone that I stole from H's chests. I put marble that I stole from H's chests. And that's as much holy stone as I was able to get. I need to put some more glowstone in the ceiling. Let's go into the aether, get like four stacks of holy stone, maybe, to cover up the rest of this cobble. And then also I need to cover these walls. That's the way that H went to find bosses. I went this way. I could use some more of this cloud right here. In fact, I could use some from down there. Now let's just go back to the mainland and, and just mine Honestly, as many stacks of holy stone as I can have the patience together. It is much later. You can tell the lighting's different. It's a little bit dark out. This is maybe two and a half hours later. I knew that the most work was gonna be hollowing out this place, and it was. That took four hours, but I am done. I borrowed a lot of H's supplies, but I don't think he's he can be mad at me. I'm gonna give him back these pickaxes. I'm not going to repair them though. I decided to go with the Aether theme. So this is what I made. You can't really see it from up here. So you come from, I didn't make this area quite as big, but you know what? I just cannot be bothered. This is, this is how you come in. You come in this way. This is the room. I only did, I only did stairs going down one side because I did leaves hanging off the other side. I put a bunch of the, the gold leaves from the sky root trees or whatever. And I borrowed some of H's gold and glowstone to light up the middle. I think this is about as big, if not exactly the same size as the other one. He's not allowed to complain. I used so much quartz and I mixed in marble because I just did not have enough and I didn't want to go mining for quartz. I already used all of H's supply of quartz, so that's gone. I think it looks pretty great. Great. I was gonna say good, but, well, I was gonna say great and I was gonna correct it to good, but like, I, it's great. I think it's great. There's no way he can complain. Now we can finally work on my house. Oh, I also have a, a one on my death counter because I fell out of the aether. What I do wanna do, just because I've been trying to get iron for, cause I've been trying to get iron for the fairy lights mod. We're gonna make a, a strand of these guys, so. 
How was it? Okay. This guy is pushing. I think I'm gonna make that many of that kind, and then there we go. <gasps> Cute! Oh, that's what I wanted! I also can do one here. These look kind of cute. One above my bed and then one over here for my TV and lighting up this little corner. Mmm, I like it. Are you ready to see your new dragon lair? I sure am, shooby dooby doo. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. <laughs> you know, I got a present for you too. Why do you say it like that? It sounds like you're gonna kill me. Please don't. Come on, let's go look! <laughs> How proud are you of this build? I'm pretty- okay, I'm pretty proud. You told me copy and paste, right? Don't forget that you told me to copy and paste it. Did well, you literally make it block for block? Because that would be dope. Okay, so we're gonna go look at it. But here's what I did. I was going to decorate for your fancy, please remind me her name or his name, the one with the fancy sparkly wings. Uh, Azrella, Mistress of the Moon. Yeah, so I decided not to make it for that one because oh. <laughs> I had so many blocks from the Aether from building my house. So I figured why not build it for the Aether Dragon? Oh. So. Okay. Let's go take a look. Okay. Is it just a, is it a bigger empty room than you just did? <laughs> it's just a bigger empty room. That took the most time. I didn't add these things. I didn't think about this. I might add some of these. Just, just, no, I'm not Are adding there... anything else. I think it looks great. You can. I have something else hanging from the ceiling, so. That's. It's Why all I feel like it's a dead body. <laughs> just a body hanging from the ceiling. Okay. I'm putting faith in you right now, Shelby, it's and not very little. Block for block, but it is pretty darn close. Oh, it's cute! It's for the Aether oh, it's Dragon! Really cute. It's sparkly! I it is sparkly! <laughs> the stairs only go one way, but I hang leaves from the other side. You didn't put the stairs going both ways? Well, I was trying to copy and paste, but you know what? I, I ran out. I Okay, I ran out of quartz. You also you were, you ran out of quartz. You also ran out of glowstone, and you, you ran out of um, marble. Where are my prizes? My rewards for doing all that work? You, you gotta remind me what exactly. They were the Valkyrie Okay, things. the Valkyrie, the th three pieces of Valkyrie armor. Okay, there they are, got them. 30 rubies. Okay. I think it was 30. I might go back and check. It could have been 32, but I think it was 30. Well, I'll just make it 32 because I'm a nice Woo! guy. Don't and, you forget it. And. And? The, the blue twinkly sparkle dragon. Remember that if you throw the amulet, the dragon's going to get out. Okay, yeah, I have to put that in the chest. Uh, come into this chest. Ew, it says owner H-bomb, though. Well, I'm going to place it just to see. Oh, I, can I give you the last thing? Oh. I can't put it back in. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I may have to go find you a moonlight dragon egg. <laughs> you might. I can't talk you to owe me. To you. Well, here, here's the last thing I got you. Ooh! Okay. Now you can put haste two on that. Do you drag? Actually, can I see you put the dragon in the dragon layer and then I'm gonna go? Okay, I tried to make it look like nice. How do you. It's a dragon layer, you though. He murders so things. Okay, we'll put some bones and things, but like, it is so beautiful in here. Oh my god, I got scared because I sank <laughs> into the floor. I stepped on the you cloud. Sank into the abyss. <laughs> Aww. Hi. You he's got his little sweatbands. Yeah, like he's got little gold bands. It's missing one other thing that Chad just pointed out. Turn around. Did you throw a chicken? What no. was that? Oh, I don't you're know. throwing. It sounds like throwing of an egg. No, it's doing something weird. Okay, you're full. Yeah, it's chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Is that you clucking? What? What was that? Shelby, come down. H, I heard. <gasps> oh my god, it's. I didn't know so there was a. Big. I didn't know there was baby penguins. <gasps> so the point of the pink. Oh my. God, oh my God he... he's smaller than <laughs> the Withers. Mr. Penguin here is the kindergarten teacher, but now he's in kindergarten too, so we have an issue. Oh no, they don't have an adult supervision. I think it'd be cute to see him just like sitting in a little cloud puff. I, it would be adorable to see him struggle for his life. That's not what would happen. Aww. 
He can jump back out, right? <laughs> you lost it. <laughs> you have it. I have more. No. No, 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 no. All right, now I just need him to get out. I am so... He'll jump out. Hold get on, out of my house. You're ruining it. <gasps> I don't know Are you that... kidding me? Are you that... kidding me? I don't know how that happened. I used a pickaxe. I didn't even... I used a pickaxe. Have you thought about using a normal pickaxe and not the Valkyrie one? I don't have one! <laughs> Shooby dooby doo. Can you can do that again, right? I I'm gonna I'm gonna go, but don't forget that you owe me a midnight dragon. Okay, bye. Excuse <laughs> you come and kill my penguin? You owe me a midnight dragon, which is a moonlight dragon? Moonlight, moonlight, you owe me a moonlight dragon! You can't take it back. I already did the work for it. That's going to be it for today's episode. Leave a like if you enjoyed watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.